June Kelly, BBC News at Southwark Crown Court. Now, in the last few weeks, we've reported on floods across the country. Early last year, we were told Britain was facing a drought. Our seesaw weather has sparked off an argument about climate change, in particular whether global warming is to blame. Today, the Met Office has published its projection about what it thinks might be happening to global temperatures. Our science editor, David Shookman, is here. So what are we to make of these latest numbers, David? Well, George, we get all kinds of forecasts from the Met Office for the weather tomorrow, for climate change this century, and now projections for what might happen in the next five to ten years. And it's one of those projections that's in the news today, because the Met Office had said they reckoned that the world would warm by a little over half a degree Celsius by 2017 compared to the long-term average. And they've now revised that downwards to a little under half a degree, which is interesting because if we get to 2017, just five years away, without much of a temperature rise, there won't have been much global warming for the last 20 years. Now, the Met Office and leading climate scientists all say, hang on, global warming is a long-term problem. There are bound to be natural factors at work with the sun and the oceans. Bear in mind that global warming is a long-term problem and it's yet to go away. All right, David, thanks for that. Thank you. It's been called the most important meal of the day and now free breakfasts are to be provided.